good thing you didn't listen to me when you went inside. I need in here. <laughs> what does the card mean? Oh, that's, that's a, a door. Oh, it looked like a freaking card. Grab. <laughs> oh, wait. That pallet. It's such a fun game, man. So you're gonna grab that, and that's what you're gonna kill the zombies with. But the door is gonna start. What's that? My weapon of choice. This was my dad's cane. He'd zip around here on it from time to time. Was he sick? Nah, he was okay. I actually saw him whoop shoplifters with it. <laughs> this cane's protected this place better than any guard dog ever could. Plus, he knew how to make it look cool. Like you with your hat. My dad gave it to me. See, dads are smart like that. I'm gonna go stand by the alley. Oh, way to go, Clem. Clear this door for when we find the keys. Better get this door clear, huh? Can I help? Sure. All happy. Here we go. Watch your fingers in the drawers. <clears throat> Things have been scary, huh? Yeah. It's not good. I don't know why everyone is crazy. Neither do I, Clementine. <laughs> Nobody does, I don't think. <laughs> this is the day to day. I bet my dad does. Okay, here we go. <clears throat> do you have kids? No. You don't have a family? Let's not talk about that. Do you play sports? I play soccer, but I don't really like it. <laughs> I'm not crazy about it either. All right, a little further. <sighs> Why don't you want to talk about your family? Do they, like, hate you? I hope not. It's just complicated, that's all. Why? It just is. But you love them, right? Yeah, of course. Eyes. Look, my family's gone, and I just wish things would have been different. Yeah. I guess let's finish moving the desk, huh? Yeah, let's do it. So, um... Ow! <gasps> oh. Are you okay? I hurt my finger. Is it bleeding? A little. Kiss me, baby. I'll find you a bandage. Now you can go and get the first aid kit that you were supposed to. Here's a pencil. On the right. Yeah. Has little kitties on it or something. Let's have a look at that finger. Ow. Oh, it hurt. Gosh, it fall off. Let's see if we can do something about it. Does it hurt when I do this? A little. Not too much. You sure? Yeah. <laughs> Does it hurt when I do this? Can we just put the hand in on it? A little. Gotta press the blue not button. too much. Oh. You sure? I just keep seeing the hand. Yeah. Here. Let's get this cut covered up. Yes, please. Lee? Yeah? 
what if my parents come home and I'm not there? They'll uh, track us down. Don't worry. Yeah, okay. Well, we should keep a lookout. I've got my walkie-talkie in case they try that way. Stay close to me until then, okay? It's locked. We need to track down the keys if we're gonna help Larry. Of course we do. Maybe they're in the alley. I don't know why they would be in the alley, but... Look at the top, top box. Oh, it's a TV. Oh, I wonder if the news will be on. Dad kept the remote for that thing in here someplace. Find anything? No, nothing. I know who you are. You're Lee Everett. You're a professor at Athens who killed a state senator who was sleeping with your wife. This is your parents' store. Folks around town know the owner's son got himself a life sentence, but I'm a reporter for WABE in Atlanta. I paid attention to that trial. Maybe you're a murderer, but I don't really care. Frankly, that's a skill that might come in handy. <laughs> Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? Did I? The world is ending out there. Who cares who I am? If you don't think There's people will find any reason to turn on you, her. especially when the shit hits the fan, you're insane. Whatever. You seem like an okay guy, and the last thing we need is drama out there. You've got this little girl to take care of, and... Look, don't make me wrong on this. I don't plan to. Good. Because if this lasts longer than a few days, and you're a detriment to the group, then we'd have a problem. I hear you. I'll just keep it to myself. Thanks. Don't worry about it. Well, now we know his story. Why is the cop car? Because he killed his wife, because... No, he killed the senator because he was sleeping with his wife. Senator. I mean, you know. My parents came in here hoping to survive. But it looks like one of them was hurt. I wonder if it was my dad. <laughs> Trying to be a hero, maybe. Or a protector, at least. Dude, your dad is somewhere, and you're gonna have to fight him. Yeah. Why do you sound so excited about that? Just realizing what you said. Oh. Uh -huh. On the drawer? No. I don't want to be at this angle anyway. No, I don't know what else to do in here. It's not working out that much. It's the remote to my dad's TV. Okay, cool. I'm telling you though, you you're about to go outside. Okay, well, I don't know what to do. I'm telling you, I told you what you gotta do, you don't listen to me. I don't know if you can get to the alley. I just wanted you to look outside at the alley. That's, I think it's I'm just locked. trying to get to that thing. We need to though. track down the keys. I don't think you can anymore. Larry. I think that was just for that moment. Oop. 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 Oopsies. What do you, what's that other thing? Is that an inventory or something? I don't know. Want to head back into the drugstore with me? Okay. Lee? Yeah? You're not bad, right? I, uh... Why are you asking me that? That lady said you killed someone. Was that because he was one of the things trying to eat you? Yeah, he was. And you had to protect yourself. That's right. 
Oh, okay. Hmm. I wonder if he has a key. No, if he had the keys, he would have used them to get inside the pharmacy, right? I mean, you could talk to him if you want. That's what just sucks. Alright, well, I don't know where I would even bother looking outside, though. I don't either. I'm just telling you, it's probably the next step in the story. Maybe there's a way I can get around the counter. Probably not, though. Hey there. Uh, this is Glenn, and uh, I'm kind of in a jam here. Uh, little girl, if you're there, can you put your daddy on the phone? Or on the talkie, or whatever? This is Lee. What's up? So, I'm down at that motor inn, and, well, uh, I'm stuck. Stuck? Yeah, I, uh, uh, saw a chance to get some supplies for the group, and a bunch of the Roman ones got the jump on me. I'm hiding over here, but they won't leave. What's up? Glenn's trapped down at the motor inn. Hey, Glenn, we're gonna talk it over and send a group to come get you, all right? <sighs> awesome. I'll sit tight till then. Sounds good. I'm gonna hold on to this until we get Glenn back, okay? I'll take good care of it. What do you think? I think Doug's not great around zombies. And you got your family here. I'll take Carly and her dead eye down to the motor inn, get Glenn, and get back here as fast as I can. If that's what you want to do, somebody's got to. Yeah, I'm in. Good. Doesn't sound too bad there right now. Let me know as soon as you want to head out. I could use a jog. Uh, now. So are you totally just not even going to get the pills for that guy? Oh, screw him. How's your finger, Clem? Good. It doesn't hurt so much anymore. Good. I know I'm not your dad, but if you need anything, I'm your guy, okay? Okay. Same. You're my guy? Oh, no. You know. We're gonna try to take care of each other. Yes. Deal. Let me know if you need anything. Okay. Gotta go. What's on the floor? <laughs> Another battery. There's something over there too. What did I just pick up? A battery. Another energy. energy. I don't know how I feel about you lying to Clem, but I don't know if her little child mind is ready to understand that you're a murderer. That is the least of our worries right now. It's in the past. Oh my gosh. <laughs> You're a machine. What? <laughs> All right, let's go. You gotta talk to Doug, right? I'll give her an energy. Hey there. Bar, maybe. You ready to head out? Wait, you got it. You? What? In a minute. Say in a minute. In a minute. Give her that battery. Okay, let me know. Why? So she can put it in the radio. Oh, that was there two? Yeah. And here's another one. Should be able to get it to work now. Let's see what happens. Yo, turn that radio on, woman. Is the radio busted? Better get back to it. Yep. Oh, I should have asked Thanks, that. Thanks, by the way. Sorry. Don't mention it. Just remember what I said. Yeah. I will. This one. Which one do I push? Blue. Same one, I'm pretty sure. Yeah? <laughs> Just totally. Uh, hey. It's still not working? Yeah, I can't figure it out. Let me have a look at that thing. Go ahead. <sighs> I'm a man, so I know how to do things with buttons. I thought she was a reporter. Doesn't she use stuff like electronics? As the you fixed it. Continues to spread on Isn't Jack, that hard? The death toll continues to skyrocket. WABE urges you to stay indoors and avoid any contact with individuals you suspect may have been exposed. The station is okay. In the event of a full. 
My, my producer's telling me we have to get off the air. Steve. He's just staring off at them. Oh, oh, oh god. I think you gotta talk to Court, yeah. Here, I've been finding some stuff to eat. <laughs> oh, um, thanks. You're welcome. Are you sure your girl doesn't need it? She's good. I've been trying to keep her fed and watered. You're a good caretaker. Thanks. You ready to head out? You got it. You? Yeah. Let's go. <laughs> 